Okay, so here is the brand new camo called Allegiance. Allegiance? Allegiance, right? That's how you say that word. And it's for the week eight challenges. And I just completed the challenges, which I will say are ridiculously easy. Like I completed in 20 minutes. If not for loading times, I would have probably done it fast. I recommend doing the multiplayer ones in like... I think the 100 battle rifle with four perks is pretty good on zombies. But speaking of zombies, you unlock this camo for all eight weeks completed, which I actually just did before I started uh, working on the week eight challenges. Uh, so it's kind of funny that, you know, uh, I, I basically unlocked every single camo challenge within a matter of an hour. And that's just because I discovered that completing the multiplayer camo challenge, or well, multiplayer weekly challenges is so much easier. But is this camo good right now? Hell no, it, it is pretty bad. What is this camo? I'm sorry, I'm trying to look over like my microphone, which is currently in my way, but what is this thing? It's, uh, it's definitely pretty lame. And it's like this weird style that they did for a while. And I don't know if they're going to be continuing it with like more crossovers later, but I know they had a similar camo with like the Kong versus Godzilla uh, crossover, which I also didn't interact with. Uh, long story short i just didn't really have interest in it and also college has been kicking my ass but we're done we're done so we're back on to the very insanely good oh my god my aim very insanely good zombies mode am i right uh, let's look at uh, season four oh one thing for zombies and it's in season that's okay anyway you also do unlock this bad oh i like that blue you unlock a weapon skin called uh squad game i nearly said squid game because it looks like squid game it says squad game but i swear it just looks like squid games so that's a funny reference and it basically has a, a squad on it it's for the bp50 assault rifle and i do believe it's the gang on the side of it like uh price and all that stuff can we also talk about how soap is coming back next season anyway off topic but i kind of like it it looks bumpy I like the texture on it, but of course, like if anything, I'm going to use it because I still need to get gold on that gun, but camo wise for eight weeks, the camo itself sucks. Cock -a -poop. I was going to run around and like do stuff in zombies. I don't know if there's any really big reason you see it. Is it worth it? I don't know. I I'd say no. So if you haven't gotten it yet and are like considering maybe complete. Oh my God. Come on. Yeah. Completing all the week eight challenges. I'd say skip them, probably. You don't need to. Honestly, this camo is not worth it. I think last season's one was better, which I unfortunately missed out on. Uh, and next season's one is actually pretty good. I'm looking forward to the next season one. It's like green and black. I, I'll try to put it up on my screen. It, it, they're cooking with that one. So I don't know what happened with season three, but uh, something went wrong. Well, something went wrong along the way. Um, but hey, I did it. I was really hoping we'd get like another... Uh, like weapon thing by weapon thing i mean and maybe even an attachment but i will i will be honest a blueprint is definitely better than just getting an attachment because my favorite thing is like new weekly challenges and then the reward is oh yeah attachment that i could care less even if it gives you special abilities i could care less about i've been yapping for long enough so i'm not gonna finish off the video just here because we've only checked out the camel in one weapon i'm gonna hop out of this game and we're gonna just check it out on some other weapons inside of the firing range and maybe it looks better on other guns probably this one was just not the best since it doesn't demonstrate it a lot but i don't know <laughs> i don't know i don't like it i kind of wasted my arcs and stuff it just doesn't feel worth it i guess this is cool so if you want to complete week eight or blueprint uh do it but honestly you're not missing out on much i'd recommend probably just getting the actual like special gun variations like the aftermarket parts but this nah not worth it okay and here we are i put this on a blueprint that i honestly don't know how i got but it actually looks pretty good I, I, I kind of like that it goes over it for some reason. It works for me, but I can also see how this is kind of ugly. Uh, it's fascinating. Kind of makes it glow. And it also makes a weapon blueprint animated almost in a way, if you really think about it. So I kind of I kind of like that. I also have a second weapon. Oh, yeah. A melee weapon. Um, I don't know. I'm trying so hard to try to like it. I can't. It's so bad. <laughs> Let's check out some other weapons. Oh, this one's also a blueprint. See, I kind of like that. I don't know why. I like the way the blueprints look with the camo. Um, will I ever use this camo? Hell no. 
I grind my ass off for like some of the camels inside of this game, and I'm planning to grind my ass off further. I'm not wasting my time on this thing. But anyway, uh, here's another one. Yeah, a lot of blue. It's like emojis, icons going past with a gray filter over it. And here's another one. I mean, this is kind of, oh, weird animation. It's one of my favorite weapons. It's okay. It's okay. Don't mind the suppressor on it. I was trying to uh, foolishly complete a challenge. Not thinking this. To thinking, actually, this was a recommended weapon. It was not. Uh, here's another one. Here's the dark ether gun. And I think we have... Oh, wait. There's two more. Ooh. I like that. Uh, no, I don't. I take it back. I don't like that. I take it back. Uh, and now the last one. The PP... BP... PP? BP-50. Yeah. PP-50. My favorite gun inside of Modern Warfare 3. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's that's going to be it. Uh, do I recommend for you to unlock it? No, but I mean, if you're a completionist, why not? Uh, the blueprint is okay. Kind of. Oh, it glows in the dark. Wow. Wow. I rarely find myself being in darkness. Oh my god, my aim is awful. Before I embarrass myself even more, uh, hope you enjoyed. Like or whatever, subscribe or whatever. We're actually super close to forty-five thousand subscribers, I think. So that's pretty cool. Thank you so much for that. And yeah, peace out.